take on the role of Mrs. Potts. So much for being a hometown hero. Madonna outraging people in Rochester Hills, Michigan after criticizing the city that she grew up in. The material girl recently went on the Howard Stern radio show and said the community, which is outside of Detroit, wasn't a place that she wanted to go back to because it's simple-minded. Now that remark caught the attention of the mayor there, who fired back at a letter promoting the city's achievements in an effort to make Madonna eat her words. Almost as if someone was taking a shot and called one of your kids ugly or, or silly or stupid. Uh, yeah, that's how I took it. And um, so, yeah, my some of my first drafts were a little more direct. And uh, <laughs> uh, you know, you run those by some people that you respect, and they say, Mayor, you know, you might you might want to rethink yeah, that a little bit. And the mayor also says that he found Madonna's remarks particularly interesting because uh, she hasn't lived in that city for nearly 40 years. You know, places can change. A very lucky cat is getting ready to head home this morning after a more than 2,000 mile journey. Kevin, that's the cat's name, who accidentally hitched a ride from South Carolina all the way to Southern California will soon be reunited with his owners. So this is what happened. He got stuck in the back of a U-Haul trailer without any food or water for days. The truck driver said he had no idea that the cat was back there until a food inspector heard him and pulled him out. Despite a crazy few days, Kevin is doing just fine. His attitude is great, and you could never guess that he has traveled across the country or been through any kind of trials in his life. And to top this off, um, when the shelter discovered that Kevin was microchipped, which most cats are, they contacted his owners in South Carolina, and they were like, oh, my gosh, she found our cat. Apparently, he's been missing since 2013. So now he's back. Like, both of my cats are from shelters, and they both have the microchips in their oh, back. Smart. So if they, they get lost, you can, you know, you can locate them. It's really it's an awesome idea. That's a good idea, yeah. Uh, I'm still focused on the whole Madonna story. Come on, <laughs> Madonna, you know. <laughs> I'm from the Capital Region. I've, I've actually had fights over that. You don't get to badmouth the Albany area. That's not acceptable. Mm -mm. 32 degrees. Today going to be cold and windy. Still got nothing bad to say about the weather around these parts. 34 degrees tomorrow. We'll enjoy some sunshine.